What up YouTube? Ryan's Tanks here, making a quick update video. It's been a month since my last video, and that was just a, uh, a one month mark of having pressurized CO2, so this makes um, two months almost. And as you can see, everything's still growing like crazy. Um, I mean, just you don't even have to go watch my old videos, just go look at the first, you know, video at my tank and you can watch the just look at the thumbnails from the first like four videos um, without pressurized CO2 man and it's just night and day not even comparable it's not even an option and I even did the CO2 flourish Excel had a little luck with that but I mean pressurized CO2 I spent 80 bucks you'll see it in my other videos I can tell you you know all about the system and everything but the needles have not moved in this I mean, it's just, it's on timer, it runs itself, and yeah, I mean, there's just no comparison. So, if you're thinking about doing CO2, I strongly, strongly recommend it. Um, if you want jungle a jungle-looking tank like this, because I always wanted it to look like this, and, um, you know, it just wasn't going fast enough. So, I finally caved in, I bought CO2, finally got my jungle. Now it's too much of a jungle, um, as you can see. I need to hack a lot of this stuff down and um, do a water change. And to be honest, guys, I've been neglecting my tanks the last month. Um, I've been really, really busy. been out of town on the weekends, and I just haven't been able to give them the attention they deserve. But, um, you know, having a, such a heavily planted tank, it kind of lets you get away with that a little bit. But... Um, I got a Marwool Garami and another Blue Garami in my 20 gallon since my last video. They were on sale. I had them both in here, but one of them kept trying to fight all the other fish, so I put them in a 20 gallon. And uh, my angels have gotten much bigger since you guys last saw them, and they've also laid eggs for the first time. They actually paired up, um, laid eggs, and I didn't even know if they were both male both female or what, but um, we got some eggs on the mag float there. That's about two days old. I don't think any of them are going to hatch, but I decided to leave them in there and try to let them raise them themselves so I don't have to do it. But, um, you know, if they lay eggs again, I might try and take them out and raise some angelfish fry. We'll see. But, anyways, um, all the growth going like crazy. Um, these crypts, I mean, they just, <laughs> they just don't stop getting really tall. The Wigia has gone crazy. Um, I hacked all of it down, except for like two, and now you can see there's like two really broad-leafed stems going up there. Those were the original ones that I left, because they had a ton of baby plants on them. Kind of growing sideways. And, uh, there's Mama. Get out of here. <clears throat> um, baby tears, it kind of melted all off a little bit and got like really narrow and vertical. And I just don't have the, the time this past month to keep hacking that and planting it to make it kind of grow horizontally. But hopefully I can fill that area out with some, some baby tears. Um, this Brazilian pennywort stuff is awesome. I mean, it, it went to the back of the tank, and I mean, it's out of control right now with this inaccuracy in the way, but, I mean, it just goes, and this is all, like, detached from it. It kind of, like, started a separate strand. There's some Ludwig in there, too, but bear with me, guys. I know the tanks are dirty and definitely overgrown, but there it is. It's a 55-gallon, two months of CO2. Growth going crazy, angels making babies. Um, it's doing good. My guppy tank, I'm not gonna even show you that. <laughs> Super neglected. Tons of angelfish babies, that, I mean uh, guppy babies. Here's a screenshot, that's my tank a month ago. So from that, to that, a month. You gotta go pressurized. I know some guys in the comments in my last video said they were dabbling with the idea. 
Just do it, man. Just do it. You won't look back. You can make your money back and store credit real fast with those plants. That's my 20 gallon. And to be honest, the plants grow so fast in this. Like, I've been throwing stuff away. I just. <laughs> they're so fast, I can't even give them away. My girlfriend's uh, brother set up a few tanks. He got the bug from me, and I've been giving him plants, but I mean, I just. <laughs> they grow so fast. So, I'll try and come up with some more videos, guys. Um, I'm probably just going to do update videos and respond to questions if anyone has any. But if you have any ideas or anything you want to see, let me know. Um, I might do some reviews on like some of my equipment, uh, like my homemade CFLs. They've been working wonders. Um, and then like that National Geographic light from PetSmart that was on sale. Um, it's, it's an awesome light. I'll, uh, I'll catch you guys later, and please like and subscribe. Tank on. Later.